Hi guys, Audio Guru. Today we're going to have a quick look at the Pro Channel inside of Sonar Platinum. Now, the Pro Channel is um, standard in Sonar Platinum and it's basically a built in console to each track that is available to you at any time and it contains a whole bunch of stuff. So, when I first opened this, this one up, you'll see there's a series of different uh, items in here. So the first one that came up was a compressor. Um, everyone needs a compressor. <laughs> That's a fact. Um, you can turn it on by clicking up here and turn it off again. Uh, you've got all your controls. So your input, attack, release, output, and down here you've got your ratio and your wet and dry controls. So you can control how much of the original signal goes through, which is useful. Um, then moving on down, we've got this really cool EQ. So uh, you've got plenty of control over this. You can choose your different uh, whether you want a shelf or not. Um, it, it just sounds really good. So you've got different types. So you've got G type, E type, and this basically controls uh, how significant the curve is and uh, the the Q settings. So you can actually expand this by double clicking on it and you get a larger graphical view so whenever you do something here it's also represented over here as well so this just gives you a bit more uh, freedom to work visually so that's a really handy feature turn that off for now uh, we have tube saturation which um, uh, adds a little color to your sounds or whatever you're recording and then we have a console emulator, which um, basically tries to emulate a console. So it's pretty self-explanatory. But not only that, not only that, you can come up to here, to this little plus button, and it gives you the options of using different uh, pieces of equipment. So we're going to click on this one to add a breverb. So where is it? And there it is down the bottom there. So we've got this one added now. Uh, let's say really good reverb, by the way. Um, we'll use a tape emulator, which is also good as well. It um, emulates running through old fashioned tape, which I've never used personally because I'm not that old. No, just kidding. Um, but no, there, there is a really good bunch of stuff you can use in here. And this is available on every track. So if you guys aren't using it, I recommend it highly. Um, that's where it is. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. And uh, I'll bring more videos out soon.